How are we doing sports betters? Ghost Picks team Justin here. I want to start off by saying if you guys are not subscribers to the channel, um, I highly recommend that you subscribe before Monday as Monday is when we are doing our $100 giveaway for a subscriber uh, and they will receive $100 towards any team Justin package. Uh, and you can use it on whatever you want. Uh, you can get a week package for free. You can get a couple of day packages here and there whenever you want, or you can put it towards a year package as well. Um, last night, uh, we had an even day uh, in terms of units. Uh, we got beat up a little bit in hockey yesterday. Kind of, kind of sucked. Um, but we did win our NFL and we did win our baseball play. We had the Dodgers on the money line, uh, which was a rocking chair winner. And then we also had the Browns, uh, minus one and a half, uh, which was also, I mean, it wasn't a rocking, but you could tell the Browns kind of had control of that game. Uh, got a little dicey there at the end, um, but a win's a win. That was eight units between MLB and NFL. However, with that being said, our hockey did get worked. We were on the over in the Florida Panthers, Colorado Avalanche game. Um, you know, there is an issue with Colorado. Uh, it kind of started this way last year with them as well, but it doesn't make sense, uh, you know, and it's not the fact that they're giving up goals. It's the fact that they're not scoring goals. That You watch the way they started the season versus Chicago. Uh, they absolutely rocketed in five, uh, was it three goals in five minutes? And they, they really, ever since that game, they've been kind of stagnant. Um, their inability to put up a lot, uh, to score with the Panthers kind of surprised me. Uh, we had the over at six and a half. Uh, Florida did their part, put in four goals, and Colorado only put in one. I really expected more goals out of that game. Um, it looked like a pretty, uh, I don't want to say obvious play, but it looked like it was a pretty cut and dry play that's going to have a lot of goals. Uh, and it ended up not being that way. Uh, we were also on the Islanders' money line taking on the Blue Jackets. Uh, I know I've been kind of critical of the Islanders before, saying that they're a playoff team. Um, they still got to get to the playoffs, and right now they're not playing that way. Um, once they're in the playoffs, uh, you, nobody wants to see them the way that they can play defense. And I felt like that all they've done is added a few more weapons from their play, the way they pushed Tampa Bay to seven games. Um, but with that being said, they're not playing that way right now. And they lost an OT last night to Columbus. Um, frustrating. Uh, we lost eight units in hockey. We won eight units in baseball and NFL. Uh, push on the day in units. However, those guys that were on just hockey or a top play, uh, that, that one kind of stung a little bit. But we're looking for a big bounce back tonight. Again, we have college football, MLB, NHL. Uh, I am, I feel like I'm so like, these plays that they look so good to me on paper in hockey. Uh, and then the days we kind of like get kind of roughed up, we kind of come back with smaller units just to try to um, make sure that we're not overextending ourselves. So those are the days we sweep and go 3-0, come back with two big plays and big units and we get hammered. So Frustrating, but uh, we're going to keep course and we're going to keep doing what we're doing because it's, it's, we have proven winners and that's what we're going to do here. Um, big day today, like I said, three sports uh, in this about the same amount of units as we had yesterday. It's going to be about, it looking like it's going to be around 16 units of plays uh, today if you're on the full day card. I'll be sending that out to those guys whenever they're ready. Um, big day in baseball. Boston can close out in Houston. Uh, it's going to be the real test is going to be does Houston have the pitching staff uh, to hold off Boston or are these bats just getting erupted again? Um, looking at college football, NHL hockey. Uh, NHL is actually where we're going with our free play. And we're going to Toronto taking on the San Jose Sharks. San Jose has yet to lose this year. They're 3 0. However, they haven't really played anybody yet. And we all know that Toronto has the ability to score at will. Um, I think Toronto wins this one handily. I'm going to go ahead and give them the, the free play winner on the puck line is something I don't always do, but where the price is in this game, you have to go with puck line. I'm taking the Toronto Maple Leafs puck line. Good luck. God bless. Grind on and let's go.